Okay. Hey guys, um, I'm gonna show you on a Kindle Fire or on any kind of Kindle or Amazon device how to get Google Play. If uh, I'm not sure, but I think the Amazon phone has a uh, Google Play, as you can see here. It is a hundred percent functional. I will go over and review this with you a couple times. See, fully functional, and I it took me about mm, five minutes five to ten minutes for my first try so yeah so first you have to go to this website if I can remember it from my history do 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 oh I deleted it um okay not a problem cuz I have it I took a picture of it so yay so do 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 right here android cowboy so type in android cowboy uh android cowboy kindle fire HD Google Play. Now, when you type that in, mm, you probably don't have to. But yeah, right there. I'll put a link in this for the in the description below for you to click on. So that way, everybody well don't have to just type it out. They all they have to do is copy and paste. So from here, okay. If you want to go here, it will tell you the. You just ignore all the top parts. The top parts, what we need to focus on is right here. Okay, now, okay, downloading the following files and transfer them into your Kindle Fire. Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you, you need to have this rooted. And I would, and as it says, yes, File Explorer, which is this application over here. Uh, right here, yes, File Explorer. And with that, uh, photos and back over here okay now see I already I did this for you guys so you go to the website and you download the following things in Google service frameworks Google login services and Google Play services by the way remember to have your settings let's go to security yes no 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 it's on device sorry Go to device and turn allow installation of applications from unknown sources so that way it would actually install and then after you download all of them and you have to install them one by one from first Google service framework then Google login services then Google play services now here comes the tricky part okay so download the vending ABK ooh, and download the Google Play Store 4.1.10 now you need to go to allow me to show you using the application here's what you need to do I'll be showing it step by step so you go to your ES file explorer and ooh, that's pretty that's pretty lots of pretty words um sorry random and you go to this you tap the weird button majigger right there and you tap root explorer okay and you have to hit mount RW and put them both on RW okay next you by the way do not install uh, the vending or Google Play Store so then you go to your downloads which you should be there and then you see this thing which looks like a market and then you see the Google Play Store now you're gonna take this you're gonna copy it and then you're gonna go How was the recording? It's just recording, teaching people how to record on how to get Google Play on their Kindle. Oh, can I, should I close my door? Are you doing your homework? Uh, it's just, this is almost over. I'll do my homework. This is just like a little break, and thanks for ru video ruined. Bye. Okay, back to topic. Um. Go, you uh, need to go to 
what is this? What is this? Oh, it's just one of those random commercial things. So yeah, another good thing about it, you can delete all the random commercial stuff. So then you go to SD card, you see here? You're gonna hit this button again, okay? And then this will show up, okay? Click on system, go to app, and then as you can see, I already you go to, then you go to, blah, 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 blah. well, there should be a paste button, but yeah. Well, you go and then you go like, then you hit, there's a paste button, but I can't seem to find it. And then once you're done, it should work. Then once you click on it, okay, which I will not do because it will mess me up, it will connect and you then will have to set up your account, which will then ask for your, oh, uh, ask for your Google ID account and all that stuff like that, okay? then here comes the fun part oh by the way you install it and open it then afterwards you go over to your SD card go to your downloads and then download the Google Play Store after you install it just turn off your device shut it down reboot it completely turn it off immediately and then open it back up and then you should find and then when you open it back up you should see something like this you see the Google Play Store you see the Google Play services and the vending thing oh by the way when you download the Google Play Store it says you are you are gonna override a item it's gonna override the vending thingy so that way it becomes the Google Play Store and with that you open it and a hundred percent chance of the time if you followed exactly like I said so you get this so ta-da so yeah um yeah so that's to prove it to you let's say mm, mm, YouTube okay just download YouTube I already did this but like as you guys most of you guys know the YouTube on Kindle Fire HD or any all of them or anything you download it then it won't work because it's going to say Google Play services required with this now you install it you download it install it and then you open it and then tada you can log in you can do anything you want so yeah so that's the end of this video uh, look at the next video to find out how to use the uh, freedom to hack any device so hack any game I, I'm sorry hack any game so yeah goodbye have a great time see you later